There's ten thousand dollars. It's only a game, Melanie. Part of the ritual. I can't. The Banker, released in 1989, is an underrated and entertaining slasher thriller starring the always legendary Robert Forster. Are you claiming that one of the most powerful bankers in this country is a mass murderer? They're all bloodsuckers, Lloyd. This guy happens to be the real thing. A millionaire banker, played by Monster Squad's Duncan Rager, ritualistically kills escorts with a laser-sided crossbow. Robert Forster plays the weary detective who must track down the banker through the seedy escort underworld before he strikes again. There's a subplot involving Forster's reporter X and a pimp's attempt to catch the killer as well. Maggie. Get that rug rat of yours back in the house. All right, that's it. Right from the film's opening credits, you get a nice 80s vibe. The Banker is a well-made B-movie that features a good helping of nudity, action, and likable characters. The film has some pretty clever dialogue and intentionally humorous moments. You crazy son of a bitch! Melanie? All right, maybe I met her at a party once. And? She had nice legs. Now, will you please let go? This is a little embarrassing. Where? I don't know. Now, will you please let go of me? I know you know something, you worthless piece of shit. Robert Forster is the detective who lives in a treehouse. A fucking treehouse. Who teams up with a new partner to catch the killer. Forster never phones in a performance and is always a treat to watch. One of my favorite little scenes is when Forster makes a wise crack about being an underage girl's father. Now you are 18. Hi, guy. Who the fuck are you? I'm her father. Nah, I'm only kidding. I'm a cop. And you, sweetie, are under arrest. <laughs> Duncan Rager is equally as fun to watch as a serial killer who likes to work out, watch a bunch of TVs at once, and bang out escorts. The banker is an arrogant and smooth killer that makes for an entertaining bad guy. He even has a license plate that reads Hunter on it. Hey! Hey, anybody home? <laughs> All right, pal. Come on. Come on, you motherfucker. Come on. Careful, old buddy. You could take your eye with one of these things. Special shout out to Jeff Conway, who plays the pimp named Cowboy. He also has some great lines and makes for a memorable character. Negative side, a lot of the deaths are off screen and the film is a bit predictable. Also, Forster's partner is pretty forgettable and the subplot featuring his reporter X is kind of lame. The film is part psycho slasher, part police procedural. On the nudity watch, you get a topless scene from B-movie actress Karen Russell and a sex scene from porn star Terry Weigel. I did some uh, checking on this symbol, and uh, all of this, it's from some, some primitive tribe. It's the domination of women, the return of the hunter. It's a ritual of the blood. The Banker is a pretty enjoyable little thriller that has enough cheese, babes, and awesomeness to make it an underrated late 80s slasher flick. It's shot well, and there are some memorable scenes of dialogue as well as action. I am Nicholas! Well, I'm Dan, I'm a cop, and you're fucked. You are worthy. Hey! Now drop the goddamn gun! Go get it. I got a much better idea. Dave. I got a fish for you. You get me the hell out of here, man. You just get me out. 